also do you guys remember that millionaire that i was talking about the remember the video on tiktok where i was like oh he gave me financial advice um so yeah we were talking and pretty much he just stopped talking to me out of nowhere and i don't know why if you don't know what i'm talking about the video is still on my page just scroll down where i have the like wrap on my head and the curly hair and i'm pretty much talking about this millionaire i was dating who i was talking to he took me on a date he was giving me financial advice so yeah he pretty much stopped talking to me out of nowhere and i don't know why but why a week later i ended up beating a billionaire and the dates experiences and things that he takes me to do just really upped it up a notch from the millionaire so yeah so i'm not gonna speak too long in this video but my point is what god taketh away he replaceth with better and that's that's the video that shit is crazy see fellas this is why it's very important for a man to know how to spot a bird a mile away, bro. If you meet a woman, bro, and she got fake hair, a face filled with makeup, fake eyelashes, lipstick, she's probably working, bro. I'm just keeping it real. And this is the life of a bird. A bird don't have any value. A bird only chase crumbs. Whoever got the most crumbs, a bird is always going to go to that guy. And that's just the reality, bro. And as a man, it's like I always tell you dudes, bro, don't feed the birds because it's no point. <laughs> a bird just be moving from dude to dude. It's just nasty work. Fellas, be wise out here, bro. And keep away from these low hanging fruits, bro. This is crazy. A lot of women cheat in Atlanta because there's a lack of men. And I don't care what nobody tell me. Mm. There is not enough men on this planet for all the women. That's true. So and when you narrow it down to being in Atlanta, let me I say Atlanta because, you know, I say all the syllables. But when, we, when I'm at home, it's Atlanta. Atlanta uh, yeah. But when you narrow it, when you're talking about an ecosystem like Atlanta, it is a portion of them are gay. Yep. Okay, let's, uh, let's, let's do this. We got we to gotta go to the ratio. So first yeah. of all, a portion of them are in jail. That's all right. There are good men in jail. That's one. Then you're gay. That's two. Then you're bi. Ooh, that's three. And then you're down low. Ooh, okay. So, so that's, bi and down low are two different people. Right. Then you have poly. No, I don't know what that is. Poly, poly <laughs> lifestyle. You want multiple women and you want, and, and everybody in this situation. Oh, uh, poly, oh polyamorous. Okay, I got that. you. Yeah, poly yeah. lifestyle. See, fellas. The hoops never fails, bro. It never do. And like I can always say, if a woman is on a podcast, she is who she is, fam. Look, any woman to sit on a podcast and say something like this, bro, she's just telling the world who she is. Because it don't matter if there is a lack of men or not. Once a woman commit to a man, if she's a virtuous woman, she's not going to see any other dude. She's only going to focus on her husband. But when a woman is a bird, <laughs> she's going to say some shit like this. Yeah, women cheat in Atlanta because there's a lack of men. What? <laughs> Yo, it's just crazy out here, man. Fellas, the signs are always there. See what I'm saying? And it would be crazy if this woman have a husband or even a boyfriend. Chicks like her are usually great side chicks. She probably been a side chick all her life. Now she's on a podcast giving other birds advice. It's crazy out here, man. Fellas, be wise. And I know you shouldn't go into things thinking like that, but at the same time, you have to be realistic. Realistically speaking, any given day, you can decide you don't want to be bothering me anymore. So I'm just left. And the whole time, so about my situation, that's what hurt me too, because the whole time I kept like joking about that, like, you know, one day you just gonna wake up and you ain't gonna want this no more. And that's just how it is. And then and it's sad that the guy gets to choose that. It's crazy. And the woman wanna still be, like, you know, the one when 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 women dump men, we give you warning. It's over for you thoughts. It's over. It, it, it ain't that time. It's over for y'all. The, the other thoughts made it bad for you. Yeah. yeah. Walmart, 
Oh, oh, you got that from Walmart. Look at it. Oh. What am I gonna do with that? Oh. It ain't even. It's not matching my fly. I'm not. That's I'm not dealing with it. No. Oh, you need to do better. This your homeboy, right? Yeah. Why you ain't tell him? He oh. ain't get that from Walmart. Yeah. He got yeah, he's Walmart. Like, it's cool. It's Man, Target. 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 Yeah. Target. Yeah. 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 We gonna do this in front of my family. Yeah. And if I told you to bring them up with you anyway. They all recorded. Yeah. Yeah. Do this, we'll know? put the phone down. I'm sitting on this concrete hard right like, in the forces. Oh no. <laughs> Look, it's better he found out now than later. But fellas, you gotta think, man. This chick had to show signs of who she was before he actually tried to engage to her and as a man you gotta pay attention to the signs bro if you're with a woman and you feel like you gotta spend money on her to keep her that's the only thing that's gonna make her happy is if you're spending on her that's not your girl fellas and this is gonna happen but the good thing about it is this man just dodged a bullet focus on yourself fellas back excuse me I could get a moment of your time. Of course. Do you have a name or can I call you mine? <laughs> whatever you want. Oh, I like the way that sounds. <laughs> hey, mine. Nice to meet you. How are yours? Uh, <laughs> excuse me. Sorry, I don't mean to interrupt. Uh, are you uh, a loan from a bank? No. No, because you definitely have my interest. Um, young girl, I'm, a, I'm highly flattered. I just gave you an opportunity of a lifetime, brother. How old do you think I am? 28, wow. 30 tops. 30 tops? I appreciate it. I appreciate that. My name is Kamani. Kamani. It's a great name. Excuse me? Sorry. Uh, are you a magician? No. No? Damn. Because every time I see you, everyone else disappears. <laughs> yeah, boy. It was a good one. It was a good one. Okay, you appreciated it. I definitely. Okay, I, I appreciate you appreciating it. Yeah. Yeah. What's your name? Jamal. Jamal. Nadia. Nice to meet you. Nice to meet you too. You look nice. Thank you so much. You're welcome. Excuse me. Sorry. Are Are you a dictionary? Am I a dictionary? Uh huh. No. Why? So you're definitely adding some meaning to my life. Yeah, that's what I'm yeah, it's a new one. Yeah, new yeah, style. PJ. PJ, nice to meet you, PJ. Uh, If you haven't yet, go get you some of that merch. You all already know, don't feed the birds. That's what it is. We don't feed the birds over here. So if you rock with your boy, go get you some of that good merch.